The state of Andhra Pradesh is confronted with several challenges. No doubt these challenges are faced by almost every state in this country. Though the state has, particularly as far as our state is concerned, though the state has a large coastal belt, we have regions like Rayalaseema and western parts of south coast which frequently encounter droughts due to scanty rainfall, impairing the living conditions of the people in those areas. Further, being the lower riparian state, with respect to major interstate rivers like Vamsadara, Nagavali, Godavari, Krishna and Penna, the state encounters water shortages during lean monsoon years and also havoc during high floods due to intense rains in the catchment areas. To effectively address this, irrigation is the only possible solution. In fact, uh, today's topic also tackling water scarcity in agriculture. One would seriously wonder, probably immediately the thing that strikes your mind is probably going for micro irrigation, probably going for sprinklers, to tackle a water scarcity in agriculture. But okay, these kind of things are basic necessity as to how to conserve water. But in my opinion, the bigger debate should be transferring water during the monsoon period, which is during the June, July, August, September, where it rains. And these days, due to global changes, climatic changes that are taking place, these days what you see is when it rains, it pours. You have, you're witnessing a situation where the period of rain is very small, very, sh very short in number of days, but when it rains, it pours. And during this period, effectively transferring water from one basin to another basin would be the biggest challenge to address this situation of tackling water scarcity in agriculture. This is of my firm belief that one would have to come up with cost effective and at the same time in that cost effective nature itself trying to transfer the water from one basin to another basin within the limited time, within the limited time frame. Increasing the uh, while the capacities of the dam continue to be the same, the drainage system, that is the canal system, would have to be probably uh, in the most cost-effective manner mm. widened to transfer the water from one basin to other. This would be one particular debate. Uh, what I would urge this council to, this commission to seriously contemplate, because this is one particular uh, site that we are seeing, especially in, in uh, my state, mm -hmm. when it rains it pours. And I think uh, this is a global phenomenon which we are all witnessing.